61A Lecture Number 12. Announcements. This weekend we'll hold a gorilla section on data abstraction, trees, and lists. Saturday from 12 to 3 p.m. in Corey Hall. I strongly recommend that you attend that if you want to master this material. Homework 5 is due Tuesday. There will be a homework party on Monday to help you out. And then the maps project is due on Thursday, but you get a bonus point for submitting early by Wednesday. There will be a project party on Wednesday to help you out. I've also asked for TAs and tutors to hold extra office hours next week so that when you arrive in regular office hours, you should see more staff than usual and therefore get your questions answered. If you're in office hours and you find that there are a lot of people there, it's probably because there are folks who aren't even waiting to ask questions. They're just hanging out and working on their homework or project. Sometimes the room gets too crowded as a result. I ask that if you're just working, please try to leave the room and work somewhere nearby. Then you can ask questions when you need to, but you don't prevent other students from entering the room if they need to do that. So let's all just work together to make sure that office hours flows smoothly, even though we have only a limited amount of space. The staff has put together a walkthrough video of midterm one. So if you still have questions about how to approach different problems, take a look at that. There are also walkthrough videos for lab, discussion, and homework. You can find them in the table. So here's a video about how to solve homework one, and here's a video about how to solve lab one. There's even a video for how to solve lab four, already posted, even though lab four is not due until today. And that's because I wanted to give you all a chance to understand what's going on with lab four. It was a longer lab than usual, and so many people who attended lab weren't able to finish. Regarding attendance of lab, we have a new policy. Starting next week, Anyone who actually physically attends the lab session will be finishing the lab. That's because we're going to provide enough support that even if the lab's a little bit too long, we'll make sure you get through it. Um, lab's only supposed to take an hour and a half a week. It's not really supposed to extend into another assignment. However, we're not going to be posting videos of how to solve lab before lab is due in the future. So if you don't attend lab, you're completely on your own to solve the lab problems. My recommendation, start attending lab again. Lab attendance was down this week. I know that you have other midterms and you think you can just do it on your own, but sometimes you'll learn more if you come to lab. And so it's a good idea to do that. And we'll also give you this guarantee that if you stick around, you'll end up solving the lab while you're there, as opposed to having more work to do after you uh, complete the lab session. 